Hi there, I'm Jeff Gagne, Product Manager here at Neo4j, and thanks for taking the time to watch this video where I'll introduce a few of the new advanced caption control functions that we've added to Neo4j Bloom starting in version 2.8. Let's get started right away by having a look at this data set that includes information about different wines from different wineries around the world and tasting notes. Let's use the show me a graph function to get some data on the scene, and you can see that we have some connections here between different wines and their varieties. When you hover over a node, you get some information which you can adjust using the new caption controls by selecting the node type from the legend panel and then selecting the text header. Here you can see that you can choose to show information from different node properties on the node or on hover, which is the tooltip you get when you hover your mouse over a particular node. We can also adjust the relative sizing of the text, as you can see here, while we adjust the variety label on the variety node. Let's go into the wine node now and add some text for the title of the wine. And we can also decide whether or not we want the styling to be adjusted and whether we want to add some things on hover by selecting those boxes as well. We also have the option of choosing whether to display the caption above or below an icon if an icon is present, and in this case we'll show it below for the wine and leave it as the default of above for the variety. Here we can see that when we hover over a wine category node, we can see the different properties that we selected to show on hover, and the styling is appropriate and the different captions are available on the different categories as well. You can also apply this type of styling with a rule-based style. So here, if we look at the wine node category and select a rule-based style based on text, we can choose the price property and say that we want to show some information about the price when the price is over $20. Specifically, what we're going to do is we're going to make the header or the title of the wine show on these nodes, but we're going to make it show in a slightly different style from the other titles on wine nodes. So this way we'll know that if we see a wine title that is bold and underlined, then that wine is priced at $20 or greater. I hope that you found this useful and that you find lots of uses for the new advanced caption controls that we've introduced into Neo4j Bloom starting from version 2.8. Thanks again for taking the time to walk through some of these new features with me and feel free to get started today at neo4j.com by setting up a free instance on AuraDB Free. There you can try out Bloom's features in the free version of Bloom under Explore, which is powered by Bloom and Neo4j Workspace, or by launching the Bloom standalone application.